be doing a labeling lesson. We've been talking a little bit about labeling our work, and now it's time for us to really think about what things could we label while we do our writing. We can do it in our writing journals, we can do it in our, in our um, Reading Street journals, we can do it all uh, every time we draw something. So let me show you my, my stickies. Let's see if we can figure out these words. I'm going to be labeling myself today. You're going to be labeling me. So this would be my, what do you think this word is? Ewa? No, I'm labeling me. What is it? My um. eyes. This would be my, think about what letter these start with. My face. My head. My arm. Good reading. My This one's a hard one. You ready? My abdomen. That's kind of like my body. So you can get this one. My leg. My hand. And last one. My foot. 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 Okay. So here we go. I'm going to call you up, and you're going to get get to pick a sticky, and you're going to label me. Okay, just like I was a drawing. See if you drew me right now, now you're ready to label me. So I'm going to call you to come on up and pick a label to label. Come on up and pick a label. Tell me what the label is. Yep, take it right off the board. <coughs> He's got, what's that? Oh, eyes. 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 So he's going to pick them up and he's going to stick it right on my eyes. <laughs> Oh, is it? Oh, is it the right way? It's falling off. Oh my! Yes. Okay. So he's gonna do just like that. That's my eyes, right? Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Next person's gonna come on up. Come on up. She's gonna take a sticky and she's gonna label me. What sticky are you gonna take? Oh my abdomen. Where's my abdomen? I showed you. She wasn't here. Oh, my abdomen. It's my body. So come on over and stick me. Stick it right on me. Make sure it sticks right on there. Good. She's so gentle. She doesn't want to push. So now we've got my eyes and my abdomen labeled. What's my next label? Um, Come on up. Can you go ahead out, my friend? Sure. That's my. Oh, my foot. I'll put my foot up. Oh, my feet are a little dirty from being outside. He's gonna label my foot. Stick it right on me. Up. Oh, I lost my abdomen. Sorry. There we go. Oh, well, stick to my, you know what? It probably stick to my skin better than my shoe. My shoe's dirty. Okay, there's my foot. Thank you. My next one. Come on up and grab a label to label me. It's going to be my head. Head, head. head. There's my head. Oh, my gosh. Next label. Come on up and label Miss DH. Someone who has not come up, come on up, my friend. Oh, my abdomen does not like the sticker. 
So he's going to go ahead and grab that one. And that's my arm. And he's going to go ahead and label my arm. Stick it right on there. Okay, so Miss DH is all labeled. If you were to draw a picture of me, these would be the labels that you would label me with, right? Okay, so today what your job is going to be is to draw me during one of your centers, and I'll help you do that in a, in a bit when we, when we introduce the centers, and you're going to label me. You're going to draw Miss DH and you're going to label me. You're going to label my face. You're going to label my eyes. You're going to label my hair on my head. There's one more in there. You're going to label my hair. I'm going to leave these up here so you can spell them. You're going to label my hand. You're going to label my arm. You're going to label my foot. I might have to get a sticky for that one. Let's put a magnet up there. That one got dirty on my foot. You're going to label my foot and you're going to label my abdomen. Okay? Oh, do I have one more thing? You might forgot my leg. I would be hard, have a hard time walking without legs, right? So today, during your center, you're going to draw a picture of Miss DH, and you're going to label these labels on your picture. And I'll leave the stickies up so it can help you. But I saw a lot of people starting to sound out their labels, too. So if you know the letters, then you write what you hear. And it's okay if it's not perfectly spelled, because you're starting to learn your letters, and you're starting to learn that letters put together make words. And I'm really proud of you for that. Okay, go ahead and turn this off.